Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Kelly. If this is your first time stopping by, thanks for joining. Today's video is just gonna be kind of a day in the life um, video of me like cleaning and organizing because that is what my life is as a mom now. So we're currently on our third floor. The previous owners finished this room off. So it has a full bathroom and then also has our attic space, but we've been using it as a playroom slash TV room if we want to have like movie night together. And because our son has gotten older, he has accumulated a lot more toys now and they are starting to take over the space. So we were trying to think of like the best storage system type of thing and honestly, toy chests can get like very expensive for what they are and I feel like they're just like a pit of doom of unorganized things. So I figured Ikea is, I mean, one of the best places to get things for organizing smaller spaces. So we picked up the Iket uh, system from there, which is just like four little, well, eight little cubbies. And then we picked up some little baskets to go in there. And let me tell y'all, <laughs> So we picked up these baskets and we just like the way they look. I get home, get home and yesterday I was getting ready to put these units together. So I opened all eight of the baskets and put them together, of course, because why would it, why would I wait to see if they would fit into the compartment before I would open all of them? Of course, they would not fit into the compartments. Uh, they were like two inches way too big. I shoved one in there and when I was trying to get out, I broke it and I was so incredibly mad at that point. <laughs> so I immediately went back on Ikea's website and looked at the um, measurements, ordered a bunch of new baskets for pickup, which I didn't know they had pickup, but thank goodness, because Ikea is like 30 minutes away from us. And then I packaged all the other ones back together with like rubber bands, because of course, how they were originally packaged, I couldn't put it back that way. Um, and I took them down there and exchanged them. <laughs> so. Uh, now I have different ones that aren't as structured and a lot more like flimsy. I didn't know they were going to be like that, but they will be fine because at this point I just wanted to get this done. <laughs> but anyway, I'm going to show you what this room looks like right now. It is a mess because I had dumped all the toys into the baskets thinking I was just going to shove them in the compartments once I, once I was done building it and then they didn't fit. So I just dumped them all on the floor. It isn't normally this messy, but this is real life moment right here. I feel the need to explain everything. Behind this blanket is a sub that my son will not leave alone. And so because of that, we have draped this blanket across it so that he does not attempt to climb over it or somehow mess with it. Um, <laughs> and then the, um, the, really the only thing that's in this little TV cabinet is my husband's Xbox and then the sound bar sits on top of it there. Uh, but there's not really anything else in it. I think my old Wii is in there, but he will not, my son will not leave it alone. And so that is why these pillows are like this. And that bin is in front of an outlet because that's where the TV plugs into. And he will not leave that alone as well. <laughs> if you have any solutions or determinants, uh, let me know. And we put this really attractive bumper um, pad around the edge here. And it had like little corner pieces that were separate that were stuck up there too. And my son decided he wanted to pull those off. He would not leave those alone as well. So that's what that looks like. But honestly, we just want to get rid of this piece of furniture and have something else, um, which will be further down the line. The couch is a love sack couch. We do really enjoy it. It's huge, it's movable, you can look it up. Has some extra cushions, so that's why those are there. Um, and then, this is my husband's old toy chest thingy that my father-in-law brought over. So it is a big old bucket that we've been throwing all of his toys into and it's fine it'll hold all the toys but then it's just i mean there's nothing organized in there and so I decided that it's time but this is all these are all of his toys they're just everywhere I and mean, he has this table and chairs that he clearly does not sit at he's 13 months so i built one of the systems yesterday it's actually very simple to put together there's like I mean, it's definitely the most simple Ikea piece that I've ever put together in my entire life, which is saying a lot because <laughs> you know how tricky some of their stuff can be. And then these are the storage 
bins that we got. So it's the Puda. And they are gray, like a felt. But I think they're going to be really pretty. Oh, and I just remember the legs that go on this are still in my husband's car. He went to go play golf. So we'll just have to put that up later. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and build this second one. Put all these baskets in here and then put these toys in here. So we, I know it won't stay organized. Clearly, he's going to pull every basket out, but at least there's a way to organize it and we can start to teach him how to clean up after himself. And I don't think this will take very long, so let me go ahead and get started.
this is how the area ended up turning out. I still have a couple more toys in here that are a little big, just like one or two. Probably honestly could just take them out if I wanted to get rid of that completely. <laughs> like I could potentially get another one of these. Um, uh, what do you call it? Another one of the compartments to go right here and it would fit perfectly. And that would be nice. I still need to put the legs on it. Um, so I will do that. And then once my, um, they're in my husband's car. So once he gets home, I'll put them on and then come back and show you. But I just left this little mat right here. That way he can pull all these out and tumble onto this little mat. I have no idea where that missing puzzle piece is. It's probably under the couch somewhere. Oh, I'm out of breath. And then I just put his little table here and his little music table is over there. He has this basketball goal over here and it kind of just hung out in this area. And so I've kind of left it there because I feel like if I put it back over here, it's going to start to get very cluttered. So we shall see. I feel like I, it's kind of cluttered. I need to get rid of something and I'm thinking it's going to be you. We also have some photos coming in from the photo shoot that we did that will go in those frames and we'll hang those there. So it'll come together more. I got those throw pillows from Ikea. These are from Target. And then the love sack, we got the little um, cup holders from love sack to go on the couch as well. I'm gonna go get somebody up from their nap and then show him and see how he tears everything. Up. Hey, hey little buddy. You just, you, you look mad cause mama was trying to clean your nose. And you hate when mama tries to clean your nose. Look what I got. Look what I did. Hey bud, look. Look at all your toys. Do you see it? Oh, let's go look at it. Let's go look at it. Oh, look at all your toys. You're not concerned? You, you're not concerned at all? You're just gonna run away from the toys? Benny. Mama put the toys away for you. Look at the toys. You're not concerned? I'm more concerned with the remote. Well, guys, we'll come back and see if he's uh, more concerned later on. I'm fine if he leaves it like that. You want to show the people what you're eating? What you eating for lunch, bud? So I got peas and carrots, sweet potatoes, zucchini. I normally eat all my food. And I like my food immediately. I don't like to wait.
so it's like nine o'clock and i'm old now so i go to bed at like nine nine thirty um so i'm gonna go upstairs and get ready for bed thank you guys so much as always for watching don't forget to subscribe leave a comment down below and thumbs this video up and i will see you guys in the next one bye